What's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to take a look at this video called Jurassic Park Evolution Movie Dinosaurs vs. Real Life 1993 Animated and it's by Tell It Animated. So uh, we've seen uh, some of this guy's uh, videos before. I mean we've seen like the evolution of Godzilla, the evolution of King Kong, but we have never seen something like this, and that is exactly what we're going to be doing today. And, um, I'm really, I have personally have never seen this video before. This is going to be my first time watching it. So, um, and I am genuinely very excited for this because Jurassic Park is one of my most favorite movies of all time. So I am so excited to, to watch this video. So let's just um, get right into this. Tell it animated. Beautiful so, screen. Want to create living dinosaurs using preserved DNA? <laughs> Mr. DNA, that's dance. funny. Well, they won't be 100% accurate. But how do the 1993 Jurassic Park dinosaurs compare to the latest science? Let's find out now. Animated. Jurassic Park's Brachiosaurus has its signature head hump with added nostrils, an S-shaped 30-foot neck, and trunk-shaped legs. The real Brachiosaurus... Okay, okay, so, guys, first off, we've got the biggest dinosaurs of all time, the Brachiosaurus. Which, as a matter of fact, Brachios... Fun fact, Brachiosaurus is actually not the largest dinosaur of all time. It is actually another sauropod called the Amphicelius. And that th and that thing is ginormous. It's almost as tall as Godzilla's kneecap. Eh, eh, anyways, so that anyway, so this is uh, the Brachiosaurus in the actual movie, and as we could see, it's it already looks amazing. I mean, it does look like the actual thing, but let's see what the real one looks like. It had a thicker neck. A longer body and more unique feet. Their head hump was less steep and their nostrils were closer to their mouth. It's also possible, like many dinosaurs, they had more colorful patterns. They also couldn't chew like a big cow, nor would they rear on their hind legs. Okay, all right, ladies and gentlemen. So now we've got uh, like a thing. So now we've got like a like. Like, there's the real Brachiosaurus right here. And then here's uh, the, the other one. Which one is your most favorite? I mean, I mean, my opinion. Now, unfortunately, I can't have you guys actually, actually commenting on my videos. Because apparently YouTube decided to, um, to not do it. So, sadly, I cannot read any of you guys' comments. Because apparently, YouTube does not allow it. And, because... Anyways, so that. Anyways, so like what I was um, so like uh, what I was um, saying. We've got um a size comparison right here. In my opinion, I think um, I'm like this one. I'm like the live, the real live version is pretty cool. But um, the Brachiosaurus and the Jurassic Park films. That's always gonna be my favorite because that's usually what I think of what a Brachiosaurus looks like. Was actually modeled off the similar giraffe titan whose proportions were closer to the oh okay so it was modeled after giraffe titan okay i get it all right on top of his head it has a lizard like frill and spits venom two attributes that were made up for the movie the real del uh, okay i'm ladies and gentlemen so um so get so ladies and gentlemen all right so this is uh, the, the the jurassic park dilophosaurus so, um, I do know that Dilophosaurus don't have these things on their heads. I do know that. But, um, I don't know. But I'm curious to see what the real one looks like, so let's find out. It's Venom, two attributes that were made up for the movie. That the is true. Dilophosaurus was much larger, their snouts were more tapered, their head crests sat lower, and they potentially had some feathering. Also, like all dinosaurs... Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so this is the, um, the real Dilophosaurus. And honestly, I think I like this one a lot better, actually, because, uh, even though that I don't think Dilophosauruses are actually feathered, actually, I think they're, I mean, like, this is scientifically accurate, so I get what Teledanimated is trying to do, um, but I don't know if that's scientifically accurate enough. 
I, I don't think so. They lack the ability to pronate their wrists. Nevertheless, they would still be a yep, there we go. For Nedry. The <laughs> is cornfish beige with arc Oh, Gallimimus, all right. The adolescents have additional white markings. The real Gallimimus have... Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so this is all the... So this is the Jurassic Park Gallimimus. I mean, like, in the movie... I mean, like, this version, it doesn't, um, look bad... But the movie version, I loved it. I loved the movie version of the Gallimimus. I just, I don't know why I love it. I just love it. It's just amazing. Smaller hands, prominent feathering, and a more angular face. The live-action Parasauropolis features green. Oh, okay. I'm um, hold up, hold up. We, we got to go back. Feathering and a more, more angular face. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So this is um the uh the real version of a Gallimimus, and honestly, I can see that because um I do remember seeing this type of a Gallimimus. I do remember seeing that. So that um so yeah, good good job, Talent Animated. Good good job with the design. Parasaurolophus, man. Why he why you say it not correct? With more hoof like front feet. Don't no, no, hold up, hold up, hold up. We, we gotta go back right now. Like, long head crest. The real dinosaur. Okay, so first off, you already saw what the real one looks like. But this thing right here, that is usually what I thought of what a Parasaurolophus looks like. But now. With more hoof like front feet. But, but now, um, it look. But now this man looks like this. And honestly. I do agree with that also because I did see a lot of pictures on Google that showed this type of Parasaurolophus. So um, I like big shout out to Tell It Animated. Possibly use their head crest for communication. The on-screen yep, yep, true, true. Has a spiked frill, three head horns, and elephant-like feet. Plus, their poop piles are disturbingly enormous. The real dino. Ha all right, li all right, ladies and gentlemen. So this. So this is the uh the Jurassic Park Triceratops. Now, when I first saw the original Jurassic Park, I kind of thought that this was uh what the real thing looks like. But the real one Slender appendages, an elongated head, large cheek horns, a higher eye placement, and distinct hexagonal scaling. Also, yep, the real one uh, looks like this. So, honestly, I didn't think uh, that Triceratops uh, looked like that, but apparently that's true. Their frill could have housed more unique patterns. The live action huh. Tyrannosaurus has an earthy color. My boy T Rex, boy bad. And extremely poor eyesight. The <laughs> had a full body figure. Okay, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> hold up. Okay, so this is um the original T Rex, and over here. I kind of, like I mentioned about the other dinosaurs, I thought that that's what the T-Rex looked like, because, I mean, the T-Rex, he just, he looked um, pretty, um, good to me, I mean, but, Skull and extremely poor eyesight. The <laughs> that's kind of funny, full body figure, tinier arms, possible feathering, added lips, and impeccable eyesight, the in-film Velociraptor. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so this is the, uh, the real one, and honestly, I'm assuming uh, that this one is based off of the, um, by Prehistoric Planet, which, um, d go ahead and I'm um, gonna check out that film, guys, it's really worth a watch, it literally has David Attenborough as the narrator, and you know me, I love David Attenborough, actually, so, definitely go ahead and I'm um, gonna check out that film, it's, it's worth a watch, but, but that is what a T-Rex looks like, I'm assuming. So, uh, let's, um, cut to the next one. Brown coloring, long hands, enlarged sickle claws, and cat-like eyes. An adorable raptor hatchling is also seen. Real velociraptors Okay, so this is, uh, the velociraptor in, Jur in, um, Jurassic Park. And as you could see, I mean, like I said, it, I mean... I kind of uh, knew that Velociraptors didn't look like that because basically because raptors are not that big, all right. So like, yep. Bird-like legs, arms, and facial features, and potentially lacked the. 
Yep, see, yep, that's exactly what I'm talking about. That is exactly what a Velociraptor might have looked like if it was real. But that look, but uh, yeah, I mean that 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 is what a real raptor looks like in my opinion. They were definitely clever girls, but most odds couldn't turn a door handle. Although the movie raptors are actually based on the larger Deinonychus, which had a more blunt snout. Yep, but I, I do know that. They look more like turkeys. They were very much still deadly animals. So, yep, that is true. Covering each Jurassic sequel, share this video and comment down below to let us know. Thanks for watching. Shout out to the pig. Okay. All right. Well, that's um, that's where we're gonna be ending that video. But I do have uh, some bonus um, videos for you guys. This one is called Jurassic Park in Two Minutes by Slick. So uh, now that we've seen uh, like uh, like some more scientifically um things, let's just um, watch to some silly animations. So uh, let's uh, see uh, what Jurassic Park will look like in two minutes. Let's see. Here we go again. <laughs> Oh, I remember this scene. What the? <laughs> that was definitely not... <laughs> what the? <laughs> wait, 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 hold up. Did you see how the raptor just looked on the... Ma uh, look at the raptor. <laughs> He's so confused. <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> Someone fire that man, please. What the heck? <laughs> Dancing dinosaurs, why not? True. Oh, come on. <laughs> that's hilarious. Aw, baby raptor, that's so cute. It's adorable. Oh, he's having flashbacks. What? Well, don't kill him. He's just a baby! Jeez. <laughs> Languish, Jeff Goldblum. My goodness. Languish. My boy Rexy just ate a goat toll. Why is... Who said that? Oh. Oh. <laughs> My goodness. Chill. And he ate the guy. I do know that. <laughs> Why did he not eat the guy? Oh, yep, there's um, there's the there's the Dilophosaurus. Oh, I know. Who yep. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is so frustrated, man. I wouldn't want to be a T-Rex because hey, I can't do anything with these little arms. Oh no, not the little arms, Joe. Come on. <laughs> That's funny. Why are all I, I love Slick's animations, they're hilarious. What don't subscribe uh, Like hey you heard the man hit the subscribe button And now let's look at this one called Jurassic World Dominion but in two minutes Also by Slick but, um, I think we might have uh, seen this video before, but just to be sure, I'm gonna watch it again in case you guys didn't see the other video. Or, um, if I didn't, um, watch this video, then, um, or if I didn't watch this video, then, um, I guess this is the first time, so let's just, um, get right into this. What the? Ha! <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Wait, hold up. Was that a Giganotosaurus that just fell on him? Was that a Giganotosaurus? That was a Giganotosaurus. What the heck? Dude. Oh, great. He's trapped in a bird cage. Definitely, I'm going home and check out Jurassic World Dominion, guys. It's worth a watch as well. Oh. <laughs> you better do it or else he's got to shoot you. <laughs> the Jurassic Park 3 joke. It just cracks me up. Stop. Stop. <laughs> they don't even know what he's doing. That's funny. Hold up now. Hold up. 
<laughs> you mean to tell me that Slick, A.K. that Slick's avatar, which is Godzilla from the from Godzilla Mothra, King Ado King Ghidorah, Giant Monsters All of Attack, is act is driving a car? Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's that is hilarious. I okay, that was a good one. Good one. Good job, Slick. <laughs> Dude just got hit with a motorcycle. Oh no. Watch your jet. Watch your jet. <laughs> this is hilarious. Oh, the Therizinosaurus. What the? Disgusting. Okay, okay. The mumble, mumble. We gotta go back. Mumboy, what kind of a Therizinosaurus is that? Mumboy right here literally just took that deer and then just used some Dragon Ball Z moves. Like, let's just look at that again. Disgusting creature. <laughs> Don't. Get out of my sight. Bro, <laughs> calm down. Jeez. Oh, no. Is that a gu is that a cow? Oh, I love that sound. That was from Super Mario 3D World. I like that. Does this man have powers? <laughs> okay, Owen. What? No re What do you know to store it? Yep. <laughs> oh, he saved the deer. Okay. I had a boy jigging on a Saurus. You try. Yeah, don't. Yeah, don't. Thank you. <laughs> oh, hey. Oh. Wait, uh, what did? Wait, uh, what did he say? Wait, uh, what did he say? Oh, hey, man. Long time no see. <laughs> oh, no, not the Dragon Ball Z thing. <laughs> you mean to tell me that the dinosaurs were doing a movie that were just watching the movie the entire time? And now to the other video, which is called Jurassic Park 3 in one minute. Pteranodon really cannot catch a break. Alan. <laughs> Alan. God damn it. What the? Oh. This is ridiculous. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah, boy. Hello there. Hello there. <laughs> Spino. Wait. Wait, wait, what? He said, we we meet again, Spino. Ba back down, y you can't defeat me. Whoa! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> you mean to tell me that this T-Rex actually thought that he was... So it was just a dream sequence. Great. <laughs> Poor T-Rex. He just wanted longer arms. Jeez. Oh. Oh, great. He's calling for... He's call... No, he's not calling for help. He's calling for a doctor. <laughs> what the? <laughs> what the? Uh, Five Nights and Freddy's? <laughs> What the? Has no dick. What was that? <laughs> by the way, that other song that was actually from the movie Dinosaurs by Jim Henson Productions, by the way. You should check it out, even though that I do not. I kind of don't like it. What the? Okay, okay. My boy Alan just turned us. Just turned. 
the movie version of a Spinosaurus into that. Uh, into a real Spinosaurus. Okay, well, that goes very well with uh, of what we just um, talked about with tel with Talent Animated. Talent Animated should really do a part two. Okay, and I mean, that was... Okay, then. Well, I guess... Well, I guess the humans and the dinosaurs are gone. And now to the final video, which is Jurassic World, but in one minute. So, let's see uh, what what this is. Jurassic World in one minute. What's your problem? It's in the cage! It's in there with you! <laughs> oh, boy. Hello. <laughs> Those are just kids. Okay, guys. Here is the plan. That big old dinosaur over there. Bro. Bro. Take him down together, though. So please help and don't betray me. No. No. I think you have the facilities for that big man. <laughs> fair enough. Tell me, fair enough. A few minutes later. Oh my like goodness. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. <laughs> what is up with that? Blue? So majestic. <laughs> What's next? It's time to go! It's time to go! Oh, my goodness. Wait, did the T-Rex just fart? Hold up. He did fart. Nice. Blue said nice. Well, well, well. And what that is where we're going to end today's video. So guys, let me know. So and that is where we're going to end today's video. I'm not I know that this was a bit of a longer video, but you know, I just thought uh, that we should do him a longer one cuz I got to be honest, I didn't even know that the video was going to be this fast. I mean, well, this long. So, guys, if you guys have enjoyed today's video, then hit that like button, also the subscribe button, if you haven't yet, and also the notification bell. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Thank you guys so much for watching with me. I love you guys. Uh, goodbye.